Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Margarita and today we're going to talk about July favorites. I have tried so many great products. Let's see what stood out for the month of July. If you want to see my favorites, keep on watching. We're back and my beauty specialist is back too. Hey. <laughs> He's excited to do his intro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so uh, this is July favorites, and I know after the last six or eight videos in July, we got some good products here. So uh, this is the best of the best. Y'all stick around; it's gonna be a good video. All right. Okay, monthly favorites is my favorite video to film because this is really the compilation of all the great products that I tried for the whole month and actually used and loved. Before we start, I want you to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and please follow me on my social media accounts, Facebook and Instagram, both Margarita D. Wooten. All of the products that I will be discussing today will be listed in the description below for your convenience to shop. And please use my link to shop. <laughs> Let's start with brushes because every time I do my YouTube, I forget to mention what brush I use and everything and I'm getting a lot of DMs if I can <laughs> mention the brushes and now is the time because for the month of July, I featured these brushes, Sonia G brushes. <laughs> I love Sonia G brushes. I've been buying her brushes for more than three years now and for the month of July, I just want to recommend, highly, highly recommend these two sets that she came out with. I featured them on month of July. <laughs> these two sets of uh, Sonia G. This is luxury brushes, handmade in Japan. For the other one that you saw that I showed earlier, I have them for more than three years and I have a habit of washing all my brushes after I use them and I don't experience any shredding. I mean, this is an investment. I, I sure is. It's hard to uh, recommend this because this Fusion set is great for cream products. I use all of this in the YSL video where I use this for the foundation, I use this for the concealer, and this is great for cream products. This is especially made for cream products, and this is retail for $225. This Lotus set, which I am crazy about, look at these handles. They have their bestseller Chick Pro here, Worker. The one that I really like is this new one, the tiny one. It's called Soft Definer. It's so small. It's perfect for your outer corner and it's perfect for my small eyes. <laughs> this set is $215. <laughs> it's crazy, the price. That's why Beautylish is offering like four payments, installments. Every time I buy these brushes, that's what I do because it's a lot of money for brushes, right? Oh, good brushes though. Yeah, I will say that. Yeah, just don't let your kids get a whole thousand on them do your artwork, you know? Ah! I mean, good. For the month of July, I started doing drugstore makeup, which everyone has requested. Not everyone, some. <laughs> And I reviewed some uh, drugstore makeup that stood out and ended up being my favorite. And let's start with e.l.f. primer, multi primer. Looks like this look. I almost finished it in a month because after using this, I use it every day. This is a perfect dupe for Tatcha silk canvas. This is $9. Tatcha is like $50. Yeah. Why not? <laughs> it, it. <laughs> it gives you a perfect canvas you know when you put it on it feels like a little silicone but at the same time like moisturizer and fills in your pores makes your makeup stays longer what more can you ask for for a primer for nine bucks mm. highly recommend and the next product that i will show to you guys is not really a primer but in the video of westman atelier i use this as a primer this is actually a highlighter it's called lit up highlighting stick in shade nectar so this is how it looks like it is great as a highlighter see but uh, when i did the westman atelier video I used this 
as a primer for their foundation. The combination of this highlighter, making it as a primer on Westman Atelier's foundation is perfect. It is great yeah. for both uses. Yeah, it actually lifts your face up nice. By the way, all of these recommendations, I just want to let you know, you guys, I have dry skin, acne prone. If you're oily skin, maybe it will work for you, but this is guaranteed to work for dry skin. And the one that I will highly recommend is this e.l.f. Body Primer Applicator. This is $6. I love this so much. This is the one I use to scoop out this primer. You know, I've been using the Tatcha for so long and it has a small applicator that I think I lost the day I bought it. <laughs> and since this is a uh, bigger with a brush, this is really helpful for me to keep your primer or anything that is cream. Keep your fingers out of the... Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> that, that's the purpose of it. It has a brush that I don't use, but you can use it if you want to. <laughs> Plus your fingers are dirty. No. Yeah. When it comes to primer, I want to massage it on my face and make sure that I will fill up uh, my pores because I got a lot. For $6, I mean, mm. highly, highly recommend. <laughs> Let's go to foundation. And since I talk about Westman Atelier, I will talk about their foundation. I'm in a shade Atelier 4. I belong to light to medium skin tone by the way. So this is how it looks like. These two, the reason why I swatched them together because this foundation has a mixed review. Some people love it so much, some people don't like it at all. Because for a dry skin, and if you will put this without a primer, I don't think you will love it. But if you have a dry skin like me and use a primer, this highlighter as a primer or anything that is moisturizing, this is perfect. Packaging is nice. Oh my god. It's, it's like a, a plus. Bam. <laughs> <laughs> you can never go wrong with it. Yeah. By the way, the highlighter, I forgot how much it is. $48 and for the foundation, $68, which is expensive, but it is a luxury brand. What to expect? Yeah. I'm recommending another foundation. This is the Catrice True Skin Hydrating Foundation with Hyaluronic Acid Longwear. I used this when I filmed The Bronze Goddess. A big YouTuber reviewed this and it becomes viral for a reason. This is $11. <laughs> so if you're on a budget and you're looking for a great foundation that lasts for the whole day, buy this. You wear it 24 hours. <laughs> I oh, bought yeah. this at Ulta, but now uh, at Ulta is like out of stock. I I hope they will return it back to stock, but I think it's available on their website. This is for normal to oily skin. And I'm dry skin, right? So what I did on that video is I put a moisturizing primer because if you will use this and if you're a, like me, has a dry skin, and you did not use a moisturizing primer, you won't like it. Or you have another option, you can mix it with a beauty oil, just one drop, to make the consistency more smooth, so you won't feel that matte if you're dry skin like me. Mm. But for oily skin, this is perfect foundation for you. <laughs> Can't be for $11. <laughs> yes, right? Yeah. And for the concealer, what I highly recommend is this Shantakai Le Camouflage Stilo anti fatigue Corrector Pen. <laughs> I highly recommend this when Shantakai did their 30% off. This is my favorite concealer because this is two-in-one. It acts as a concealer and a corrector for my mature skin, mature under eyes. Perfect for me because it doesn't accentuate your fine lines, which is great, right? <laughs> and it doesn't make your under eyes dry or crack. And it's so hard for a mature skin to find a concealer that moisturizes your eye bags or mm. wherever you put your concealer. This mm. is one of the best concealer I ever tried. And it's a luxury makeup. It mm. retails for $55. Not too bad. It's got a nice applicator to it. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. See? That's what I'm supposed to hear. I keep on track. It's, it's a click pen, 
like uh, the white Celtic chocolate. I don't want to click it because <laughs> it's so expensive. I don't want to waste it, but you just click it and yeah. it will come out. And this brush applicator is so easy to put it on. I have all the videos on this. If you want to see how they perform and the full review of it, you can go back and see mm. my videos. All the videos in July. Usually when I do my makeup, I, I set my makeup right away after the concealer. But this time I won't because the one that I will highly recommend is a cream contour stick West Montelier. Here it is. Mm. And you all know yeah. West Montelier. I have the shade Truffle. This is the darker one. The other one is Biscuit. I chose this because I belong to light to medium. When I contour my face, I want them to show up. Don't get intimidated by it because once you blend it on your face, it melts <laughs> in your skin like butter. Where's my Atelier products? I will bring them on our vacation. We have an upcoming vacation coming up. And since the packaging is thick, she designed it women on the go easy to use it's sure. just so perfect for traveling all yeah. of this will be in my travel makeup bag and that's my next video what's in my bag <laughs> highly highly recommend for the blush i will highly recommend this cream product that is still west montelier <laughs> i love west montelier if you notice <laughs> when i did this video i use her products almost every day and you know, I have to remind myself to use other products because um, I have a lot of makeup to choose from, but it is so good. And I, it's like, it's me. If I want something, I just wanna use it just like every day. Which I'm really forcing myself to put this down and use other makeup. This is the shade of the blush stick. This is $48. This is in shade Dudu. <laughs> yeah, I remember the name. <laughs> Describe as warm rose. And again, don't get intimidated because look at my cheeks. It looks like a natural flush sun kiss on your cheeks. It doesn't look like this because you, when you blend it out, I just use my finger when I use this on the video. It's just so perfect. Oh yeah, I remember that. Yeah. I love, love, love this. $48. Yeah. And now it's time for me to set it. I don't have a setting powder to recommend this month, but I have this finishing powder that I use as a setting powder when I did the YSL one brand full face video. This is called Touch a Cloud 3D All Over Glow Universal. And it looks like this. It looks dark in the pan, but don't get scared because it doesn't register dark. It will just make your face glowy and look healthy. I won't lie, after that video, I use this every day. I love it so much. <laughs> and it's so funny because I bought this like a few months ago. I never touched it because I have so many makeup, but when I, I did it in that video, actually this is a first impression on the video, and now it's my favorite. Highly, highly recommend. I bought eight dollars. The highlighter that I will recommend is this YSL. It's called Touch a Cloud Shimmer Stick Highlighter. This is shade gold. This is thirty four dollars. And look, wow. <laughs> it's blinding, right? And that's what's on my cheek right now. It's pretty. This is the base. I put another one. One swipe and just in the monitor it's blinding so blinding you gotta wear shades that's how good it is the thing about this it doesn't disturb your foundation this lasts all day it like melts on your skin and everything feels like butter highly highly recommend and this is only 34 dollars okay i have another one for you it's drugstore you guys and this is juvia's place loose highlighter and look when I use it in the video, The Bronze Goddess, I just use the one in the cap. And I still have a lot. This $17, I think, will last me for the rest of my YouTube career. <laughs> because just a dot of it is blinding look. And it has the gold tone that I really, really love. I swatch it. <laughs> oh, yeah, it actually looks better. Sunglasses. <laughs> you know what? I don't know if I want to give you all my videos because 
<laughs> Instead of me focusing on my job, I got distracted. <laughs> this eyeliner is so good and it has a gold tone that I'm crazy about. This is what's on top of that YSL. My cheeks, you guys. Oh, Isn't yeah. it nice? The one that I put on my forehead, my nose, my cupid's bow. Look, I just <laughs> dip my hair and it has a gold reflex that's so lovely. It's not even shimmery. It's just so reflective. It doesn't accentuate any pores or any texture in your face. Actually, I have a lot, but it makes me look like I'm flawless. That's good, man. <laughs> the best part, $17. All <laughs> okay. that price. Okay, let's go to eyeshadow. Believe it or not, I have used so many eyeshadows for the one of July, but I will only recommend one. This Chanel. This is the one I used in the video, Bronze Goddess Makeup Look. This was on my eyes. You know, I have to close my eyes for you to see it. What I did today is I wet this gold to intensify it. I wet this to put brow bone in my inner corner. It's so awesome, you guys. I just experiment. This is not like Tom Ford wet dry formula. I just wet it. How do you like it, honey? Look. That's great, yeah. yeah. See? That's why I yeah. highly, highly recommend. And Very this. Pigment. This is $62. Yeah. $62. Don't lose in brushes. Those things are expensive. Oh, these brushes too. This is so helpful and you can use it when you're traveling. And I will bring this on my upcoming vacation. I told you guys everything that is in here will be in my bag. Okay. All right. <laughs> and this formulation of Chanel is their traditional eyeshadow that everyone is crazy about. It's not the other one that doesn't show up. This is really very, very good. That's why I put it on my July favorites. Love it. Okay, let's go to lipsticks. I have three lipsticks in front of me. And I will start with the one I'm most in love with is the Chanel. <laughs> the one that I featured on that bronze goddess. That This is what I'm wearing right now. I top it with something else. That's why it doesn't look as beige as it is. And look how bougie this is. Oh yeah, Chanel, right? Oh well, maybe that one. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it has a logo. I don't know if I was in that video. Uh, you were. Oh, You're no. just forgetful. <laughs> <laughs> Too much coffee that day. <laughs> He's mixing everything. <laughs> so this is in the shade <laughs> OR beige. Look. <laughs> Look how pretty. This is a perfect nude, you guys. This lipstick, you don't need a gloss or anything. It's just that I want to experiment today. And you've seen this wearing alone. This is $45. Ooh. Man, that's like Tom Ford prices. No, Tom Ford is $55. Oh, okay. That's a good deal then. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> it's Chanel. It's Chanel. luminous. It's yeah. like two in one. It is pretty, you gotta admit. You, I mean, it's very. You very don't beautiful. need a gloss. No. I no, mean, no. can't go wrong with that one. Exactly. The one that I mix it with is this limited edition Shantakai Lip Chic in shade Rose de May. This is $55. But if you got it with the 30% off, it's so, so good. Actually, I dented it already because this is what I wear every day at work. This is so moisturizing. It's like a hybrid of lipstick and balm. A lipstick feels like a balm. This is the shade. I want to swatch them together. That's the one that I put on top of my Chanel lipstick to serve as a gloss. Mm -hmm. But this is the lipstick and that's why it looks like this. Highly, highly recommend. And the last lipstick I will recommend is this YSL. This is the one that I used in that video in shade Le Nude. This is the perfect, perfect nude. I will swatch them all together so you will see. Mm -hmm. It's like this is a mixture of the Chanel and the Chantakai. See, if I want to use this alone, I will look like this. But since I want to feature everything, and this one, when I use it in that video, I didn't even use a lip liner. I didn't even use a gloss because this is so luminous, just like the Chanel. It's so moisturizing. That's why it's here on my July favorites. And how much it is? It's $38. Those are the lipsticks that 
I highly recommend become my favorites for the month of July. And the last one that I will feature is this Tom Ford Soleil Blanc Shimmering Body Oil. I have two. <laughs> this is Soleil Blanc and this is Soleil Nudge. Before I use it, I mix them because it's oil based. Look at my chest and everything else. Oh, I put it on. That's why I shine. The glitter thing? Yeah. And I want to put more. Okay. Just one spray. And look the effect of it. You need yeah. me to do that for you. <laughs> no listen to him. <laughs> this is just a demo. For the shot. And, um, he loves the scent of this. This is, you know, why I highly, highly recommend this because this, <laughs> mm. <laughs> this is Tom Ford, and this is not just a body oil. This is like a Can body. Cut this video it's short. <laughs> This is a body oil and perfume in one. This has the gold specs and this has the silver specs. I love them both. Actually, I love this better because the, sh the scent of this is more subtle. If you use this, you can layer it with another perfume. If you use this, I don't layer it with another perfume because the scent of this is already good enough for the whole day. Mm -hmm. And this is $100. Four. This is the big size, 3.4 full ounce. I can't live without my vacation. We're going on Jamaica without this because I want to look cute. We're going to leave this beside the bed from now on. <laughs> okay, that wraps up our July favorites. Among all of what I mentioned, my favorite of all my July favorites is this two town for it. Mine too. Mean... Yeah, <laughs> now that I smelled it. It serves as a moisturizing oil. You look great because you look like bronze goddess or whatever it is. Yeah. And mm. my beauty special loves the scent, so what more can I ask for? Oh, me, right there. Okay, you guys, <laughs> thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And please hit the notification bell so you'll be notified every time we upload a video. Right. And please, please, please share our video to help our YouTube channel. Yeah. Thank you so much, you guys. We love you. See you on our next video. Right. Bye. Bye. Peace.